Hi guys, Paul Pluto, Paul Pluto channel. We're doing paid reviews. This is MA6. And before we do that, I invented the wristwatch check. I did it. I'm the one who invented it. And here we go. The wristwatch check. I'm wearing a bluesy, two-tone bluesy, 16613 V serial number. Absolutely. I've wanted this watch for over 20 years. Over 20 years. I've really fucking wanted one. Okay. I've got some monies come in here, and this is from, this is, what the fuck, um, okay, this is from Brian, uh, he goes, Paul, I really want, I really don't want anything else in my collection, but I welcome your review, okay, good, 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 this is a man who thinks he's happy, yep, yep, I heard it all before, let's, let me be the judge of that, Brian, let me be the judge of that, before you, you, you make these outlandish statements. Let me have a look and I'll say yes or no, okay? Because I got a feeling, I got a feeling there could be shit missing, okay? Okay, let's jump in here. What do we got here? What do we got? What do we got? I need my, my extra. This is fucking the font this guy's used is so fucking small. Fuck me dead. The font he uses is so fucking small. I can't even fucking read this fucking thing. Okay, here we go. Okay, oh, I'm gonna put my magnifiers on. Fuck me, Daddy. He uses this font that is fucking ridiculous. Okay, here we go. Here we go. That's better. Paul, I don't really want to add anything else to the collection, but welcome your review. Okay, I have the following: number one, a Rolex Bluesy Submariner, two-tone, maxi dial, pre-owned. Love this one. So that's the ceramic uh, Bluesy. Check. Number two, Patek Philippe. Ooh, 5196R, pre-owned, paid under 11,000 US. Spectacular to me. Yes, yes, I, 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 I quite get that. Number three, a Rolex Explorer 1, 36mm, 2003, pre-owned. That'll be a 14, 14270. Number four. Jegula Cultura Reverso full size stainless steel pre owned transparent case back. Whew. It doesn't say what model, probably like a, a 976 or something. Number five, fuck you, we've got a uh, deep blue Rolex James Cameron bought first year out. It's appreciated in price. Cool. Number six, we've got a Basher 1963 verified Horace Horistic 33 mil small, but I love this piece. Number seven, Rolex new Pepsi. Fuck. Stainless steel bought from AD, bought at MSRP. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, number eight, we've got a Pam 88 GMT. Not my favorite, but bought pre owned for 3500 Wife loves this watch. It's okay. Number nine, we've got a Rolex 1973 Air King 34 mil, bought around 2002. Number 10, bought my wife a small Reverso stainless pre owned. Number 11, bought my wife Rolex discontinued but new Yachtmaster two-tone chocolate dial, two-tone rose gold, bought new but with was discounted 20%. She loves this watch. It's a bit big on her but she loves the rose gold and chocolate dial. I thought about adding a Daytona pre-owned stainless but I really don't think I want a chronograph. I'm blessed to have this collection built over 22 years. Wasn't overnight. Thank you for all you do, Brian. And I, I got to be completely honest and frank with you, Brian. I think you are one of the few people who actually got it on the head. You've nailed it. Fuck. You got a perfect collection, Brian. That's, you know, you don't need to add anything. I, I, I quite agree. Fuck. You don't really need to add anything at all. That's a magnificent collection. I love the bluesy two-tone with the maxi dial. I admit, you know, I love, I love my, um, I've got the, not the maxi, the pre-ceramic. And uh, I'm going blind. I, 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 I'm going blind. I'm 47 this year. And I, I must admit, I think the maxi is probably, probably better for use. I love I love the, the vintage charm of this one, but but that's a great watch. Uh, you got a five one nine six R rose gold. Fuck, that's beautiful, 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 beautiful. You can't argue with that. You didn't pay eleven under eleven. Fuck, that's cheap. That's cheap. 
it's cheap. They're a 20 grand watch. Um, you got an Explorer 136 mil? Yes, sir. Yes, yes, that's a great watch. I've got the 39. If you're a smaller guy, I think that's a that's a great watch. When I say smaller, not a fucking fat, fat fucker like me. Then you've got a Reverso full size. Fuck. With the display back. Yes, sir. -y. That is, um, that's pretty damn cool. That's not just cool. That is, uh, that's pretty fucking good there. Um, I, I gotta be honest with you, this is a fucking beautiful collection. Um, I, um, I think I might have got this wrong, Brian. I think I got it wrong. Um, yeah, I think, I think I got it, I think I got it wrong. Uh, so I, I do apologize there, Brian. I, I, I do apologize. Um, what else can I say there? The James Cameron, that's a fucking heavy hitting dive watch. That's a fucking monster. You got a um, 1963 Vacheron. Yes, 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 yes. That's um, that's pretty cool. I must admit, I, I loved Vacheron myself. I was a huge um, Vacheron fan myself there. Um, Pepsi, fuck. A new Pepsi. Fuck. Fuck. How did you manage to... How did you manage to get that? That is, um... You're a fucking lucky guy. My God. Um, I don't know what to, to say there. The Pam 88. It's okay. You got an Air King. And you got a few... Brian, I think you got it, man. And Brian's a nice guy. He um, he always sends me. If he sent me a few emails, Brian, I think is from Canada. He sent me Christmas regards in 2017. He's a, he's a pretty good guy. Um, he's fucking. He's pretty cool. He's very cool, man. He's, he's Brian is a. He's a nice, really nice guy. I like nice people. I like nice people because. I need nice people in my life because I, I get lonely with cunts that I'm surrounded with, okay? So, um, that's, I, I think it's perfect. I, I, I honestly, what more do you want there? What do you want? What do you want there? He's got divers, he's got dress watch, he's got a um, number of dress watches, he's got a GMT. Fuck me dead. Would I add a, a Daytona? I don't think it would hurt, but I, I think your collection is magnificent enough there. Uh, I don't think you need anything, Brian. I, I, I tend to agree with you. Enough is enough. You've, you've fucking hit it. You've hit it. You've hit it. You've hit it, okay? Um, you can stop collecting. Wow. I didn't think I didn't see that coming. It's it's, it's really nice. He's got some. I, I think that's a perfect collection. Wow, you got some really uh, nice stuff there. Um, Brian, well done, well done, well done, well done. I I I'm just kind of speechless. It's it's so much more than the sum of the pieces. Um, I think you you've hit it. You've hit it on the head. Well, I I. I, I mean, would you add a day to Well, it's up to you. If you want to, you can add one. If you don't, you've got beautiful collection. I can see your wife. You love your wife. That's good. You're a good man, Brian. You're a good man. That's important. That's very important to be good men. We need good men in this world. Brian, well done. Well done. i got nothing to add. That's fucking perfect collection. Um, I, I don't think you need to add anything. What a beautiful collection. I wish I could have that fulfillment. I don't know why in my collection I don't have that same fulfillment. I'm always yearning for more. Like at the moment I'm yearning for a two-line sub. No date. I'm yearning for a two-tone ceramic GMT. I'm yearning for a 519. I just never seem to be happy. 
I never, I just can't get the formula right. I'm always missing something. Um, well, well done. So there we go, guys. Remember, guys, like, subscribe, tell your fuckwit friends. A few nasty comments would be very handy about now. And uh, please um, remember, paid reviews keep me on YouTube. I can't live on Google Ads alone. I need, I need your help to keep me going. If I didn't have your help, it'll be fucked us. It'll be all over Red Rover. It'll be really difficult. So, guys, do remember these paid reviews keep me full time on YouTube. Thank <laughs> you.